at St. Mary's School and we have been asked the two toppers of the HSLC examination. Uh, so how do you feel? I feel really good right now that I'm able to represent my school and I got the sixth rank all Assam. So it feels really surreal and heavenly right now and it feels really good. So how many hours did you study? Initially, uh, when we came to school, like during the first months, I used to study three to four hours every day. And after the pre-test examinations, when we got a month off, I used to study at least eight to ten hours. So, what's your biggest motivation? My biggest motivation is that I want to become something in life, and I want to make my parents proud. That is the thing that keeps me going because my parents have raised me and they have tried so hard every day so I have to do something in order to make them proud and that is the thing that keeps me going. Okay, uh, who were your biggest supporters? My parents, my mom and dad all the time and they always motivated me and encouraged me to keep going and they never pressurized me to do bring at least this much, this much marks so they are my biggest supporters. Uh, so did you expect that you will get this position? I never expected this. I did not have that much belief in myself. Like I really tried really hard for the exam, but I expected a good result, but not uh, the top 10 rank list. My friends, my classmates, they were from the beginning of the year. They were saying that uh, you will get a rank. We know that, so they believed in me. So I want to uh, thank them a lot for the belief. Okay. Any tips that you you would like to give to your children? Um, since the students were in class 10 right now, they are going to give metric next year. So there is a pressure around from the society as well to perform well in the metric examinations. But I just want to say that if we are satisfied with ourselves and like we should do according to our capabilities, like we should not push our limits because our body can also handle a certain amount of stress and we should not take too much stress and we should get priority to self-care as well. So that's what I want to say that we should complete our lessons every day what is taught in school and just try to complete within the syllabi of the school curriculum. How do you feel? I feel extremely blessed and I feel overwhelmed definitely. Uh, so how long did you study? Uh, so how long did you study for um, I studied around five, five few hours uh, regularly and after going from school I really felt uh, tired. That's why uh, my main priority was setting up a goal for the entire day and um, I ensured that I completed all my goals before I went to sleep. And in that way I did not have any fixed time but uh, my uh, main goal for that day was to complete all the tasks which I uh, had set um, in the morning. Okay, so what's your biggest, what was your biggest motivation? My biggest motivation uh, was uh, to get a good percentage because my parents and my um, uh, near and dear ones, they had always uh, told me that it, it would be very good if you can get a good percentage. So um, that was the uh, first thing which motivated me and uh, the day when I began class 10, uh, I thought that I have to do something uh, by which I can make my parents feel proud. So um, that was the motivation. If you know why you are doing something, then the motivation comes from within. So who were your support? My parents and my teachers. So did you expect that you would get to this position? I expected um, that I could get a good uh, percentage, but not a rank like this. I just uh, ensured that I uh, remained regular all throughout uh, the preparation time and uh, that's what. Uh, any tips that you would like to give to your juniors? Yes, definitely. Um, the uh, day when we begin the uh, class 10 journey, people always have a notion that, oh, she's very smart, she can definitely get a good rank. But it's not like that. Sometimes even a slow learner can uh, definitely get a good rank. It all depends on us, how we take up the challenges, because uh, there are many ups and downs throughout this journey. You, you could get uh, good marks sometime or uh, some bad marks, but you have to have that, um, that motivation from within that you have to do something and uh, if you have that motivation, definitely um, you can ace all the problems throughout the journey.